All right, so before we start the video, um, well, I mean, we're kind of already starting the video, but I just wanted to show you guys the, uh, the pump uh, product. So we're gonna do two scoops of the Adrenaline Underground by our boys uh, Black Market. And then we're gonna do a scoop of some non-stim pre-workout. It's, uh, it's called Pump Fuel. Uh, this one's called Insanity. Fucking absolutely delicious. Amazing flavor combination right here too. Something that you can actually tolerate. And I'm gonna be doing it with a brisk tea uh, lemonade. And I actually got this from a coworker at work. Um, it's got a lot of like really good natural sugars in it and stuff like that. So I imagine it'll be good for the pump. Um, but yeah, I'll see you guys in the car talk. So on top of that, we got some more pump medication, some more <laughs> medication, bro. So I've also got some of uh, your anabolic pump. So we're going to be using that today too. Um, and then we've got our pump one as well. So we're going to be taking some of this shit and uh, getting into the gym. Man, dude, I, I tell y'all what, honestly, I cannot stress enough how much I enjoy spending time in the gym. Like, I, it's probably like my, my favorite part of just existing is going and putting in maximum effort into this thing that progresses my body, eating super, super healthy, it, like keeping my body fed, feeling nice. You know what I mean? Like, and I, th I think that's one of the biggest things that I really, really enjoy in life. Like it's, it is a very, very nice time. Um, I, I just can't stress that enough. I fucking, I, I love this shit, man. It's just a different type of, uh, what's it called? Um, a different type of love. You know what I mean? Like, it's like, it's like if sex was, you know, in your brain, you know, what? that's, <laughs> I know that sounds whatever, but that's how the gym is for me, man. Like I fucking love it. Like, I don't know. Dude, that tastes so fucking good with the lemonade. Oh my God. But it's a little like, you know what I mean? Like it's like, <laughs> but now nah, real deal though, honestly, this tastes fucking awesome. Like, man, wow. All right. I really, I really fuck with that. Um, I'm going to drink a little bit more of this and then start driving because usually I get on my like little rants and I forget about this and then I got to slam it whenever I get to the gym and then I got to spend like 20 minutes waiting to, you know, lift and it's like, dude, um, so, but today we're starting off with our biceps, then we're going to go into shoulders and then we're going to go into, no, 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 we're starting off with our forearms. Then we're going to go into our biceps. Then we're going to go into our shoulders. Then finish the workout off with a nice, juicy uh, tricep pump. And then we'll go ahead and do our pose down. Um, honestly, I was thinking about bringing some shorts because LA Fitness has that pool. But I don't know, man. I don't know. I don't know if that's something I want to do or not. I'm, I'll think about it. Yeah, no. I don't, I don't, I don't want to. Not, not today, at least. Maybe tomorrow because tomorrow's leg day so that'll honestly that'll be pretty nice going into the pool after leg day that'll probably be really really nice man dude i'm fucking my beard's getting kind of kind of thick i don't know you can see where it's like kind of patchy like all right through here and like uh eh, it's it's getting better i don't know as i'm getting older my hair is getting a little bit more thicker and it's coming in a whole lot better but i can comb it kind of over like that kind of yeah no I, I can't I can't I just can't and then there's like a patch right here where it's like supposed to connect but it doesn't <laughs> but yeah mm. drink just a little bit more all right that's enough we'll probably drink the rest on the way over there oh man Let's get it. 
Just get going. Man. Dude, so... I, I don't know what it is about, like, after lift or during... Sometimes even during lift. Like, you get this kind of, like, like post-nut clarity type of feeling, I guess you would say. Um, and you just think very, very well after a crazy hard gym session. Like, you've really pushed yourself super, super hard. Like, your body's feeling super good. Um, and... God dang, dude. Jesus Christ. Fuck, man. Um, but yeah. So, I would definitely say that uh, whenever you kind of go to the gym and work out and, you know, just push yourself really fucking hard, you just, like, feel some sort of, like, like, otherworldly presence kind of taken over and like you you can think well and you can you know kind of like make good decisions in that in that time period after you lift and honestly I think that's one of my favorite portions of lifting too is like it's got a very good mental health benefit towards it because like you know some people before the gym are like super super angry and some people after the gym they're like super super you know like mellow and i i feel like the only reason they are like that is because they just went to the gym some people man they'll be like really really sad all day they'll go hit the gym and they're fine like they feel good about themselves like everything like that i think uh See, the only reason that I changed whenever I go to the gym is because of the morning time, it being dark. So it being dark in the mornings, like I, I've got to wait till, what is it? It's, it's not daylight savings. It's the other one. Um, or is it daylight savings that, fuck, the, the one where it's like, I think the time jumps forward or jumps backwards. I don't know. It's some, some shit, but uh, whenever it gets brighter earlier is whenever I start going in the morning again. But until then, we're going to be going in the afternoon so that you guys can see me. But my preferred workout time is about five, six o'clock in the morning, to be honest. I, I really enjoy working out that early because it, it adds a, a nice start to your day. Like you wake up, you feel like shit, you go to the gym and you feel great. And then you feel great for the whole day. And it's like, well, why not do this every day? You know what I mean? So it's just the whole car talks and you guys being able to see me and stuff like that. That's that's why I'm going in the afternoon. And even sometimes whenever I get out of the gym, it's night. And I'm like, damn, bro, fuck. It's already nighttime, dude. But I don't know. Like sometimes I definitely spend a little like too much time in the gym. Like, you know, just talking to people and stuff like that. Like after I, after I you know, do my whole pump thing or my my pose down and stuff man like I, I don't know like I, I kind of feel like an asshole for doing it you know hanging out and talking to people but it's like I'm not going out and partying you know what I mean like I'm not going out drinking I'm not like so it's like I don't know that's just my my time to like hang out with people I guess I don't know like I've, I've got like my food at the house you know what I mean like I just I don't know I, I mean I got I got my coworkers, man, but I mean, most of those guys only speak Spanish and it's like, my Spanish isn't great. And since I'm like, they're, you know, their boss, they're not going to sh shit around with me. You know what I mean? Like they're just not. So it's like, I, I mean, I don't know, like I'll, I'll joke around with them and stuff like that, but it's, I mean, I'm, I'm a boss, you know what I mean? You're not going to have the same, like reaction that you would from regular coworkers. Now, I would say like my boss, him and I get along pretty well, I would say. Sometimes he's a dick, but he's a different kind of dick. You know what I mean? Like he's a very like this is how you fucked up and this is how you can fix it, but also fuck you type of dick. You know what I mean? Like he's like he's like I don't know, like he he says all the time he's like he's like you're green as shit. And I don't know if you guys know what that means, but it's basically a guy that doesn't know anything um, about the job. You know what I mean? And it's like, 
I mean, kind of fair, kind of fair. You know what I mean? I'm new to this whole, you know, foreman thing. Um, but yeah, that, that's, I, I'm green as shit. You know what I mean? Um, but it, it's like, just like little stuff like that. That's kind of, it's, it's nice to be joked around with and stuff, man. Like, and you know, even on the quote unquote hard days, they're still not that hard. Like it's really not like the, the most stressful thing about my job is sending emails back and forth to these other motherfuckers. Like, I, I mean, that's, that's, and I, I mean, it's just mentally draining stuff. That's I honestly, like, I shouldn't really be even tripping about, you know what I mean? Like, that's not something that I really, Oh no, fucking Tom, Dick and Harry emailed me. Oh, I'm so scared. You know what I mean? Like whatever, dude. Um, <laughs> but I don't know, man. Like, <clears throat> life's just all around, like, lately, it's, it hasn't been, like, super stressful, it's been more, um, I think it's because I stopped going out and partying, and hanging out with random people, you know what I mean, I think, I think that's why, like, I think that's why life's been a whole lot more fun for me lately, is because I, I just stopped all the extra bullshit, man, like, if I'm gonna drink, I'm gonna drink some nice scotch at my house, you know what I mean, like, if, if I'm going to go out, I'm going to go take my girl on a date. You know what I mean? Like, I'm going to go have like, like a good night with my girl and we're going to go have a good time. Like, I'm not going to, I'm not going to go get fucked up in some club and you know, where Barbie is like, Oh my God. Oh my God. My, my boyfriend left me. I'm just so sad. Like, shut the fuck up, Barbie. Like, I don't care. You know what I mean? Like, I just, I just don't like, I, I don't know, I'm just tired of the, just all the extra bullshit that goes along with going out and partying, like, you know, people trying to fight other people and stuff like that, it's like, dude, like, why, like, really, really, why, why are you, I don't know, man, I need to get off this rant, I'm sorry, you guys, I'll see y'all in the gym uh, for some forearms, but yeah, all right, honestly, gym's a little packed right now, full stack of this and do some uh, forearms with these. It's going to be eight sets of this uh, for our forearms and then uh, I'll record a couple different angles and then y'all will see me at biceps. You're good, you're good. I don't want to. Uh, but uh, yeah, yeah. side of the forearm. Um, not every set though, we're probably only going to do about three sets of the reverse grip, uh, the bicep curl right here. But yeah.
going to be a drop set. This is my knees. We came with a full stop. We are down to about 72. We are down to about 42. We are down to about 20. Flip over. Reverse grip. Boom. Probably going to end it there. start off with because honestly our forearms are fucking killing me right now um so see what we got going on for it but man i'm fucking kind of exhausted already dude fucking jesus i don't know still got about four total more sets for our biceps and then we got shoulders after that probably gonna work the rear delts on the uh pec deck machine reverse pec deck um I don't know, man. Dude. Okay, let's grab some fucking dumbbells. I'll probably start off with 45. sets of these um, honestly these ones I'm not gonna push myself too hard not super heavy weight I got 70s right now at the top big pause big squeeze big pause come back down control the negative down if I start slinging it around I start slinging it around whatever um, yeah
cables uh, and then and then we got shoulders yeah of these and then move to uh, move the shoulders but yeah go ahead and get started some of the cable ladder raises. I haven't done them in quite a while, so I'm gonna kind of see how it uh, how it affects the pump. We're gonna do four sets of these, and then four sets of regular ladder raises, and then I'll probably, like I said, I'm gonna go over to the tech deck, do the reverse ones, and then we'll start on triceps. Yeah? Thank you. 
is a fucking beautiful trash can we got right here. Uh, I don't know, dude. I don't know what I'm probably only gonna work with like 25. So I'm feeling a little fried right now. I need to save a little bit of energy for triceps. So, just grab these fucking gumbo. I'm gonna hit one with these 25s. Just fucking, just get it. sets just like that i'm not gonna record them let me get them done and then uh right and move on to a uh, good old triceps yeah Kind of gonna hang our body a little bit over it on this next one. Uh, whenever I'm doing them, I kind of get underneath it, fucking push down. It gets a little bit of your chest in there, but that's all right. Honestly, the gym right now is really fucking tight. I'm uh, I'm really surprised I got I got one of these. I wanted to grab an extra pin, throw another plate on here, but I don't think I'm gonna be able to do that. We probably should have saved this for class so that we could do some more weight or be a little bit more fatigued whenever we do this. Um, we're going to do three more sets of this and then probably go over to probably a dumbbell overhead tricep extension or I'm going to grab the rope, go overhead like this, see if I can find one. And if we can do that, that's probably what we'll end up doing. Yeah. It's a little hard like this. Everybody's scheduled for different yeah, no, I could do that all fucking day. Um, we're gonna figure out something else to do because this isn't enough right now. Okay, we're gonna see if we can get ourselves a little bit more fatigued before we do that. Because like I said, I don't think I'm going to be able to find an extra pin to add any more weight to that. Because I just, like the full stack's just not enough anymore. So I got to be really fucking fatigued to do that. Uh, but yeah. double hand get him a little bit extra probably do two more sets of these or one more set of these just depending on how we feel and then try those uh tricep push downs again man Oh my god. Oh 
shit. <sighs> Fuck. Man. I hate when the gym's busy like this. This is fucking a lot of people. A lot of people. All right. set of these and we're gonna go ahead and check the pump I think I don't know I'm a little tired right now it's getting pretty fun pretty interesting I'm probably gonna do like a crazy drop set we'll take the plate off go ahead and drop down probably two or three on the stack do as many as we can and then uh, do the same thing again just a little bit further down just fucking bust them out as many as we can. Um, kind of so failure every time, you know how it is, man. So failure, I'm a failure. All right, now triceps are done right now, man. Can't even get that. over a little bit. See what it looks like real quick. About right there. Okay. I wish I could have found some fucking sub corner of the gym. I don't know how they're gonna feel about this here. We'll see. But we're gonna go ahead and get a little little pump check going right here. Do what? Uh, nah, man, nah. Go ahead. Shoulders look pretty good. Let's do a uh, little breath hold first. Side chest. It's 
with one of these. All right. Let's do this tricep. Ah, we're too fat for that right now. All right, and then back double thigh. And then back front. And then uh, I guess we'll do one of our looking pretty good. I don't know. I look pretty fucking nutty right now. I'm liking it. Enjoying it. For sure. I don't know. Like I said, we're 15 pounds heavier than when we started. And we're just looking fucking nuts right now, man. Um, folks, we're doing pretty well. Definitely enjoying life a whole lot more than I'm fucking eating properly. So, I don't know. I feel like I'm starving myself or anything like that like i'm full all day long it's really really nice um let's get this shirt back on have a little talk a little chat dude let's move this up a little bit too holy shit check out my arms though man like man. holy shit We are so sweaty right now. Okay. Man. Um, man, dude. I don't know. The public gym is a little weird, man. Like, because, like, you know, I'm used to working out of, like, body gym and bodybuilding gym and stuff like that. So, like, doing stuff like this is just... It's awkward, man. Like, I'm used to powerlifting. I'm used to motherfuckers, like, grunting real loud. I'm not used to, like, this crazy busyness or anything like that. Like, it's just, it's weird to me, man. Like, definitely, you know, small guy. But I would definitely say, uh, you know, stronger than most. You know what I mean? Like, I don't know. I just, I don't think there's much more that I could, Mike, I could ask for. Maybe, like, a, I don't know, like a, stack with more weight on it but looking good feeling good doing right i don't know man um but i'll see you guys in the, in the uh in the car talk here in just a second yeah okay that was a pretty nice gym session i will say i'm gonna go ahead and roll up my windows honestly i almost forgot to start doing the car talk like i had like no joke i was like i was like dude fuck <laughs> I completely forgot about uh, about the car talk. I, I like I like started to like roll the windows down and like fucking <laughs> play music and shit. And then I was like, wait a minute, I'm forgetting something. <laughs> we're gonna we're gonna disappear on the other side instead of this side. I don't really like going out this way. It's just a little bit like too many cars, you know, coming this way because like the lights like right there. So. Like, you know, everybody that's taken off right there is like, like right there. So over here, I at least get a little bit more time coming out of the parking lot. Like, look at that, dude. It's fucking easy, bro. Every time, every time. But if I was over there, I would have had to wait for like fucking 15 cars. Would have blown fucking, yeah. Yeah, it just would have sucked. Um, we, it is getting my words are not working. <laughs> um, it's starting to get, like, the sun's starting to go down. The sky's, like, super, super pretty right now. Like, if you guys could see it, that would be fucking dank, dude. But you can't, because iPhones, they're iPhones. I don't know. You can kind of see it to the side right now. Nothing crazy, but I don't know. It's, like, it's still too bright for the phone to pick up. You know what I mean? Like, I don't, I don't know. It's just awkward lighting. Um, but it is really, really pretty outside. That sunset is fucking gorgeous today. Like, wow, man. I don't know. Maybe if I focus on it. Oh my God. Yeah. Yeah. Look at that, baby. Oh my God. Yes, sir. I don't know. It still looks better in person. You know what I mean? But yeah. All right. I'm going to focus back on me. 
Um, but yeah, man, like, I, I don't know, just definitely, definitely a really, really good time in the gym today. Um, as I, I mean, I'm starting to enjoy hitting arms a little bit more, but to be honest, like my forearms, I think my forearms are pretty weak. Like, I don't know what it is, but it's like a lot of pain when it, I think it's because I broke in my hands so many times because I used to downhill skate and stuff like that. And like just this whole forearm area right here just kind of like hurts whenever I work it out super, super intense. But like it's whenever I'm doing biceps, it's not really when I'm directly working out the forearm. You know what I mean? So like, I don't know, maybe it's like my form for my biceps or something like that, but it doesn't hurt like the day after or anything like that. Like, and it doesn't hurt, like, like an hour from now, like, it, it's not going to hurt, but it just does right now, and I don't quite understand it. I might just have, like, weak tendons in my forearm or something like that. I don't know. I'll, I'll, I'll probably talk to a doctor about it, because I don't want to, like, hurt myself. You know what I mean? Like, I don't want to be able to not lift, you know? Like, and even if I wasn't able to lift, like, Honestly, I just attach like one of those attachments that's got the hook on it for your hand and use it like that, but like sleeve it around my arms so I could still do like biceps and shit. Cause I mean like, even if I'm injured, I'm gonna find a workaround. You know what I mean? Like, I'm not just gonna not work out for three weeks. Like, who the fuck? Like, dude, why? Like, I, I don't know. Like, imagine just like what that does to you. Like, I, I don't know. Like my, mentally, I couldn't fucking handle that. Like mentally, every time that I've stopped lifting, it's just been a bad time. And honestly, I just don't want to stop lifting. So like if there's any way possible, probably more than likely, I would go ahead and I just find a workaround, like injured or not, whatever it is. Like, I really don't care. Like I just, I have to, I, I have to be able to lift weight. Like I, I have to. I know that sounds weird, but I just do, man. Like, it's it's become a staple in my life, and it's just become, like, a usual uh, usual thing. But, yeah. Um, man, you know you don't trust people <laughs> when you look both ways, but your light's green. <laughs> like, somebody's going to be coming into oncoming traffic at an intercept, bro. <laughs> but, yeah. Um, Man, dude, what is up with this fucking lighting, bro? Look at this. I've got, like, a fucking forehead. Oh, my God, dude. I know what it is. It's fucking jackasses, dude. I guess I can't see behind me now because this guy's got his fucking brights on back there. Like, dude, it's, like, 6 o'clock at night. What you got your brights on with, like, 30 other cars around you, bro? Like, man, dude's lacking, bro. Dude's lacking. I don't know. Somebody, somebody's going to slam on their brakes, and he's going to rear end them. It's not going to be me. I'm not saying that I would ever do that. But if somebody did it to him with me watching, I would find that hilarious. <laughs> but no joke. And, and like, now he's getting, like, closer and closer. It's like, dude, go away. Go away. Go away. I don't know. I don't even know what I'm doing at this point. Like, I'm so cracked out on pre-workout right now, it's not even funny. That pump, by the way, was fucking gnarly, dude. Oh, my God, bro. Like, I definitely, like, wow. Damn damn boy look at thick you know what i mean like that's i mean that that was that kind of pump that was fucking nice dude i i really enjoyed that pump that pump was great um but yeah we got leg day tomorrow you guys um honestly i think i'm gonna do no no i'm not no i'm not i i know where i'm missing all of my weight my fucking legs man like my legs are so small like I don't know, like, even in, even in my sweatpants, like, my legs just look tiny, bro, compared to my upper body, and it's like, dude, like, I'm wearing sweatpants right now, like, how, how do my legs look small, you know what I mean, I'm like, ah, dude, you know, like, I don't, I don't know, man, um, but anyways, you guys, y'all have an absolutely phenomenal night, I will see you guys tomorrow for day number 33 of the bulk, peace out.